Good morning, church. Man, it is definitely a good morning because it is Good Friday. Without a doubt, my number one favorite day service of the year. And to be sure, there are a number of other contenders for that, like Easter Sunday, which I am really looking forward to this year as well. But there's just something special about Good Friday. There's the sense of the weightiness of what Jesus did for us. It kind of really hangs in a palpable way on Good Friday. But it's not the kind of weightiness that's all gloomy and depressing because we know what that achieved for us. It's kind of a strange mix and hard to explain, I guess. But I know that you're going to experience that today. Even as we participate in this strange service virtually and online, I'm just really expectant. I'm excited about the message that I'm going to be sharing with you. I'm excited about the creative elements in this morning's service. Uh, we've got creative elements, a time of worship, sermon, then some worship time after the sermon as well. I think just to kind of process what God might be saying to us on this day. And then of course, building towards our very special, very unique live communion time together. That's going to be happening at half past 11 for me right here, for you in your home. And I'm really looking forward to just connecting in some way with you on this special day. So I want to pray. Uh, as strange as that, as that is to do through the camera, I'm going to pray just that this is going to be a special time for everyone gathered in all of the hundreds of homes across our city. Lord Jesus, we gather before you today and I am expectant and I believe we're expectant that something of the weightiness of this day would be impressed upon us. We reflect today on, on this most central event in history, in our history. And I pray that that would be applied to us in such a special way. I know that you're alive, Lord Jesus. We, we're here on Good Friday, but we know you're resurrected, you're present, you're with us and with us now. And I pray that you would be moving in the midst of every single home that has gathered to worship you on this special day. In Jesus' name, amen.